Drake's Saga. Chapter 1. The Heart of the Forest. Discover Drake's enthralling journey in a mysterious forest. Equipped as a skilled ranger, he uncovers ancient secrets and navigates through nature's mystique. A tale of intrigue and respect for the wild unfolds. In the mysterious forest, the trees loom tall and ancient, their leaves whispering secrets of the ages. A path snakes through the underbrush, inviting yet ominous. Do you, one, follow the path, trust the worn trail to lead you to some revelation. Two, explore the forest. Venture off the path to uncover the hidden wonders or dangers of the forest. Three, wait and observe. Stay where you are and carefully observe your surroundings for any clues or movements. Choose wisely, for each decision shapes your journey in this enigmatic woodland. As you ponder your choice, an image of the dense, mystic forest around you comes to life, capturing the essence of your surroundings. Here is the image of the mysterious forest. Now, how will you proceed? Will you follow the path, explore the forest, or wait and observe? Your choice will lead you further into this enigmatic adventure. I check my equipment and my weapons. I am Drake, an experienced ranger. As Drake, the experienced ranger, you quickly inventory your equipment and weapons. You carry 1. Longbow and Quiver, a trusty longbow with a quiver of arrows, perfect for long-range encounters. 2. Dual daggers, sharp and lightweight, ideal for close combat and swift movements. 3. Herbalist's Pouch. Contains various herbs and potions for healing and other useful effects. 4. Survival Kit. Includes essentials like a flint, rope, and a small hatchet. With your equipment in check, you feel prepared to face whatever mysteries this forest holds. Now, with your skills and gear ready, what will your next move be? Will you follow the path, explore deeper into the forest, or wait and observe? Your ranger instincts might guide you well. An image materializes, capturing the essence of Drake, the ranger, equipped and ready for the adventure ahead. Drake, the ranger, stands ready. With your keen senses and well-prepared gear, the forest's mysteries await your exploration. Will you follow the path, delve deeper into the woods, or stand still to observe your surroundings? The choice is yours. I delve deeper into the woods. Guided by your ranger instincts, you decide to delve deeper into the woods, veering off the beaten path. The underbrush grows thicker, and the sounds of the forest become more pronounced. The distant call of birds, the rustle of small creatures in the foliage, and the soft whisper of the wind through the trees. As you move stealthily, you notice unusual markings on some trees and a faint trail that seems less traveled. It could be a sign of something hidden deeper in the forest. Do you? 1. Investigate the markings. Examine the tree markings more closely to decipher their meaning. 2. Follow the faint trail. See where this less traveled path leads. 3. Set up a hidden watch point. Remain hidden and observe to see if anything or anyone passes by. Your decision here could reveal secrets of the forest or lead you to unexpected encounters. Meanwhile, an image emerges, capturing the dense, deeper part of the forest where you now tread, filled with mystery and potential danger. The deeper part of the forest, shrouded in mystery, lies before you. What will be your next move, Drake? Will you investigate the tree markings, follow the faint trail, or set up a hidden watch point? Your choice could unveil the secrets of this enigmatic forest. I investigate the markings. You approach the trees with the unusual markings. Upon closer inspection, you realize they are not random. They are deliberate signs, possibly used for navigation or as warnings. The markings are a mix of scratches and symbols, some resembling local wildlife, others are more abstract. Your knowledge as a ranger tells you these could be the work of a local tribe, a secret society, or even left by another ranger or explorer. They might indicate a nearby resource, a hidden path, or a place of significance. Do you? 1. Decipher the symbols. Use your knowledge to interpret the meaning of these markings. 
2. Search for similar markings. Look around for more markings to gather more information. 3. Set a trap or alert system. In case these markings warn of danger, prepare to defend yourself. Each choice could lead to a deeper understanding of these woods or prepare you for unseen threats. An image forms, showing you, Drake, examining the intriguing markings on the trees, deep in thought and analysis, surrounded by the dense and enigmatic forest. You're now faced with a decision, Drake. Will you try to decipher the symbols, search for similar markings in the area, or set up a trap or alert system? Your choice could unlock the secrets of the forest or prepare you for potential dangers lurking in the shadows. I deciphered the markings. Focusing your attention on the markings, you begin to decipher their meaning. Drawing on your extensive knowledge as a ranger, you recognize patterns. The symbols seem to represent different animals and elements of nature, possibly indicating the types of wildlife or natural resources nearby. One particular symbol stands out, a spiral with a line through it. Recalling lore and legends you've heard, you realize this symbol is often used to denote a sacred place or a hidden entrance to something significant. This could be a clue leading to an ancient shrine, a hidden natural wonder, or even a secret entrance to an underground area. With this revelation, your options are 1. Search for the sacred place. Follow the clues to find this hidden location. 2. Mark the location and continue exploring. Note this area and keep exploring the forest for more clues. 3. Set up camp. Near the markings, stay nearby and investigate further in the morning. Each decision holds the potential for discovery and adventure. An image emerges, showing the moment of revelation as you decipher the enigmatic symbol, with the dense, mysterious forest providing a fitting backdrop for this intriguing discovery. With the deciphered symbol hinting at a sacred place or hidden entrance, the forest's secrets seem within reach. Will you search for the sacred place, mark this location and continue exploring, or set up camp nearby to investigate further in the morning? Your choice could lead to remarkable discoveries. I search for the place indicated by the markings. Guided by the deciphered symbol, you begin your search for the sacred place. You notice that the direction indicated by the symbol aligns with a subtle trail, less worn than others, almost hidden by the undergrowth. Trusting your instincts, you follow this trail, moving quietly and cautiously through the dense forest. As you progress, the atmosphere seems to change. The air grows cooler, and a faint, almost mystical light seems to filter through the trees. You get the sense that you're heading towards something ancient and significant. Eventually, the trail leads you to a small clearing. At its center lies an old stone structure, half consumed by the forest, yet still standing with a quiet dignity. It appears to be an ancient shrine or monument, covered in more symbols and old, worn carvings. Do you, one, examine the shrine closely, Investigate the structure and any symbols or objects it might contain. 2. Look for hidden entrances or passages. Search around the shrine for any secret paths or hidden doors. 3. Wait and watch from a distance. Observe the shrine from afar to see if anything unusual happens. Your discovery could unveil long-lost secrets or lead to unexpected challenges. An image forms, depicting the mysterious clearing and the ancient stone structure bathed in the mystical light that filters through the forest canopy, capturing the moment of your significant discovery. Before you stands the ancient shrine, a relic of times long past. Will you examine the shrine closely, search for hidden entrances or passages, or wait and watch from a distance? Each choice could reveal more about this mysterious place and its secrets. Search for an entrance to the shrine. You begin to carefully examine the ancient shrine, searching for any hidden entrances or secret passages. The structure, though worn by time, reveals craftsmanship that speaks of a forgotten era. As you circle the shrine, you notice that the ground near one side seems slightly disturbed, as if it has been recently moved or altered. Focusing your attention there, you find a cleverly disguised trap door partially covered by moss and earth. 
It's well hidden, likely missed by anyone not looking for it specifically. This hidden trapdoor could lead to underground chambers or tunnels associated with the shrine. Do you? 1. Open the trapdoor, brave the unknown and explore what lies beneath. 2. Inspect the trapdoor for traps, ensure it's safe to open without triggering any ancient security measures. 3. Mark the location and return. Later, decide to come back with more preparation or after exploring the area further. Your decision now could lead you into the depths of history or demand caution and further planning. An image emerges, capturing the moment you discover the hidden trapdoor by the ancient shrine, the intrigue of what lies beneath palpable in the dense forest setting. The hidden trapdoor at the ancient shrine presents a new path of exploration. Will you open it and venture into the unknown, inspect it for possible traps, or mark this spot to return later? Your choice could lead to new depths of discovery or require careful preparation for what lies beneath. I check the trap door for any traps. Exercising caution, you decide to thoroughly inspect the trap door for any traps. Drawing on your experience and knowledge, you carefully examine the edges, the surface, and the mechanism of the door. You look for trip wires, pressure plates, or any signs of mechanical or magical traps that might have been placed to protect the entrance. Your meticulous inspection reveals that the trap door, while old, appears safe to open. There are no obvious traps, and the mechanism to open it, though rusty, seems functional. It looks like the trap door was designed more to conceal than to harm. With the trap door deemed safe, your options are 1. Open the trap door. Proceed to explore the secrets it might conceal. 2. Mark the location and gather supplies. Prepare better before delving into the unknown. 3. Search the surrounding area. First, explore the clearing and nearby forest for more clues before going underground. The decision to explore further or prepare more lies in your hands. An image is created, depicting the moment of careful examination. With you, Drake, analyzing the trapdoor by the ancient shrine, the sense of anticipation and caution evident in the shadowy forest clearing. With the trap door confirmed as safe, your path forward is clear. Will you open the trap door to uncover what lies beneath, mark this spot, and return with more supplies, or explore the surrounding area first? Each choice could lead to new discoveries and deepen the mystery of this ancient shrine. I open the trap door and cautiously uncover what lies beneath in the shrine. You decide to open the trap door, ready to uncover what lies beneath the ancient shrine. With careful movements, you lift the heavy door, which creaks ominously, but gives way to reveal a narrow staircase descending into darkness. You take a moment to prepare your torch, casting a warm light that pierces the shadows below. As you descend, the air grows cooler and the stone steps are slick with moisture. The passage narrows before opening into a small underground chamber. The chamber is filled with relics of the past, faded murals on the walls, a few scattered artifacts, and at the far end, an altar with an intricately carved stone relic. The murals depict scenes of the forest and its creatures, along with figures that might be ancient deities or guardians of the forest. The artifacts look like ceremonial items, possibly used in rituals connected to the shrine. The stone relic on the altar emanates a faint pulsing glow, suggesting a hidden power or significance. In this chamber, you can 1. Examine the murals, look for clues or stories in the ancient artwork. 2. Inspect the artifacts, determine the nature and use of these ceremonial items. Three. Approach the altar. Investigate the stone relic and its possible significance. Your actions here could unravel the mysteries of this ancient shrine and reveal long-forgotten secrets. An image forms, showing the underground chamber beneath the shrine. With its murals, artifacts, and glowing stone relic, capturing the aura of ancient mysteries waiting to be discovered. In the chamber beneath the ancient shrine, you stand amidst echoes of the past. Will you examine the murals, 
inspect the scattered artifacts, or approach the altar to investigate the glowing stone relic? Each choice could lead to deeper insights into the history and secrets of this sacred place. I investigate the scattered artifacts first while carefully checking the surroundings for hidden traps. You approach the scattered artifacts with caution, mindful of your surroundings and potential hidden traps. The items, though ancient, are remarkably well-preserved. They include ceremonial bowls, intricately carved statuettes, and what appear to be ritualistic tools. Each artifact seems to have a specific purpose, possibly related to ceremonies or rites that were performed in this shrine. As you examine them, you notice that their designs are similar to the symbols you saw on the shrine above. This connection suggests a deep cultural significance and possibly a link to the practices or beliefs of those who built and used this shrine. While being thorough in your investigation, you find no signs of traps in the immediate area. It seems the chamber was meant more for preservation and reverence than for defense. Having inspected the artifacts, you can now, one, examine the murals. Turn your attention to the ancient artwork on the walls. Two, approach the altar. Investigate the altar and the glowing stone relic. Three, search for secret compartments or passages. Look for any hidden aspects of the chamber. Each decision might bring you closer to unraveling the mysteries of this ancient place. An image emerges, capturing the moment of your careful examination of the artifacts, surrounded by the age-old walls of the underground chamber, steeped in history and ancient secrets. With the artifacts examined, your curiosity about this ancient chamber deepens. Will you now turn your attention to the murals, approach the altar with the glowing stone relic, or search the chamber for secret compartments or passages? Each choice might reveal further layers of this ancient shrine's history and purpose. I examine the murals on the walls now. You turn your attention to the faded murals on the walls of the chamber. Despite the wear of time, the murals are rich in detail and storytelling. They depict various scenes, people gathering herbs in the forest, rituals being performed around the shrine, and what appears to be a celebration or festival. Notably, some figures in the murals are adorned with the same symbols you've seen throughout the shrine. One mural in particular catches your eye. It shows a figure, possibly a high priest or leader, holding the same stone relic that's on the altar. This figure is surrounded by others in a circle, under a sky filled with stars and a full moon, suggesting a ceremony of great importance. The murals seem to convey the cultural and spiritual significance of the shrine, possibly hinting at its use for communing with nature or celebrating celestial events. With the murals examined, you can now. 1. Approach the altar. Investigate the altar and the glowing stone relic. 2. Search for secret compartments or passages. Explore the chamber for any hidden features. 3. Reflect on your findings. Take a moment to piece together the clues and understand the shrine's history. Each action could further illuminate the mysteries of this ancient place. An image is created, capturing the moment you examine the intricate murals, their ancient tales unfolding on the walls of the dimly lit underground chamber surrounded by the aura of forgotten times. With the murals revealing aspects of the shrine's history and rituals, your understanding of this ancient place deepens. Now, do you approach the altar to investigate the glowing stone relic, search the chamber for hidden compartments or passages, or take a moment to reflect on your findings and peace together the shrine's history? Each choice could lead you closer to unraveling the full story of this sacred site. I examine the glowing stone relic on the shrine more closely without touching it. You approach the altar cautiously and examine the glowing stone relic. It's a beautifully carved object, emitting a soft, pulsing light that gives the chamber an otherworldly ambiance. The craftsmanship is exquisite with symbols and designs that match those on the murals and artifacts, suggesting a deep spiritual or magical significance. The relic might be a key to ancient rituals, a source of knowledge, or even a magical artifact with hidden powers. 
Its glow seems to resonate with a certain rhythm, as if reacting to the presence of a living being. This reaction could indicate that the relic is more than just a stone. It might possess some form of ancient magic or energy. Since you've chosen not to touch it, you can. 1. Use a tool to interact with the relic. Carefully manipulate the relic using an item from your kit. 2. Observe the relic's reactions. Watch for changes in the glow or any other reactions to your presence. 3. Search for information around the altar. Look for inscriptions or clues nearby that could explain the relic's purpose. Your careful examination could uncover the true nature and power of this mysterious artifact. An image forms, showing you, Drake, closely observing the glowing stone relic on the altar, the chamber's ancient aura enveloping the scene, hinting at the deep mysteries and magic surrounding this enigmatic object. The glowing stone relic on the altar holds mysteries yet to be uncovered. Will you use a tool to interact with it, observe its reactions to your presence, or search the area around the altar for more information about its purpose? Each action might bring you closer to understanding the true nature of this ancient artifact. I look for inscriptions or clues nearby that could explain the relic's purpose. You begin to search the area around the altar for inscriptions or clues that might shed light on the relic's purpose. Scanning the stone surface and the walls nearby, you discover faint inscriptions that have been eroded over time but are still legible. The inscriptions are in an ancient language, but your knowledge as a ranger allows you to piece together their meaning. They speak of a sacred bond between the forest and the people who once inhabited this land. The relic, referred to as the heart of the forest, is described as a key to maintaining balance and harmony with nature. It was used in rituals during significant celestial events and was believed to possess healing and protective properties. This information suggests that the relic is deeply tied to the forest's health and might have powers that could influence or reflect the state of the natural world around it. With this newfound understanding, you can now, one, interact with the relic. Use a tool or cautiously touch the relic to see if it reacts. Two, observe the relic closely. Look for any physical changes or further reactions to your presence. 3. Document the discovery. Make notes or sketches of the relic and inscriptions for future reference. Your decision could unlock the relic's secrets or provide valuable knowledge for your journey. An image is created, capturing you, Drake, as you discover and decipher the ancient inscriptions around the altar. The glowing relic in the foreground, enveloped in the chamber's mystical and historical aura, with the inscriptions revealing the relic's significance as the heart of the forest, your understanding deepens. Now, will you interact with the relic, observe it more closely for any changes, or document your discovery for future reference? Each choice could lead to different paths in unraveling the mysteries of this ancient artifact. I reflect on my findings and take a moment to piece together the clues and understand the shrine's history and meaning. You take a moment to step back and reflect on all you've discovered. The ancient shrine, hidden beneath the forest, the ceremonial artifacts, the murals depicting rituals and celebrations, and now the glowing relic known as the Heart of the Forest. You piece together a story of a people deeply connected to the land who revered the forest and used this shrine as a center for their spiritual and communal life. The relic, with its healing and protective properties, was likely a key element in their rituals, symbolizing the bond between the community and the natural world. Its continued glow suggests that its power, or at least its significance, has not faded with time. This moment of reflection allows you to contemplate the broader implications of your findings. 1. Could the relic still influence the forest? Its power might extend beyond the shrine. 2. What happened to the people who built this shrine? Their disappearance adds a layer of mystery. 3. How does this discovery impact your journey? Understanding this site might influence your future explorations and interactions with the forest. 
Your contemplation deepens your connection to the shrine and its history, filling you with a sense of wonder and responsibility towards this ancient legacy. An image is created capturing this introspective moment as you, Drake, ponder the interconnected mysteries of the shrine, the relics, and the forest, surrounded by the timeless ambiance of the underground chamber. In this moment of reflection, you, Drake, connect deeply with the history and mysteries of the shrine and the forest. Now, with a renewed sense of purpose and understanding, how do you wish to proceed? Your journey in this ancient and mystical place is far from over, and many paths remain to be explored. As a ranger deeply connected to nature myself, I decide to not meddle with the artifact or the shrine any further. I document my discoveries and make notes and sketches of the relic and my findings for future reference. Then I leave the place. Respecting the sanctity of the shrine and its relic, you choose not to meddle further. You carefully document your discoveries, making detailed notes and sketches of the relic, the murals, and the artifacts. These records could prove invaluable for future studies or might help in understanding the forest's deeper mysteries. With your documentation complete, you prepare to leave the chamber. As you ascend the staircase and close the trap door behind you, you feel a sense of peace, knowing you've left the shrine as you found it, undisturbed and shrouded in its ancient mystery. Back under the canopy of the forest, you take a moment to appreciate the connection between this hidden shrine and the living, breathing woods around you. As a ranger, this experience has deepened your understanding and respect for the natural world and its hidden wonders. With your journey at the shrine concluded, you're ready to continue your adventures. Whether exploring more of the forest, returning to civilization with your findings, or seeking new lands and mysteries, the path ahead is yours to choose. An image forms, capturing the final moments of your time at the shrine, a blend of reverence and curiosity in the depths of the mysterious forest. Your adventure at the ancient shrine has come to a close, Drake. With new knowledge and a deeper connection to the forest, you continue on your path. Where will your journey take you next? The world is full of mysteries to explore and stories to uncover. As a ranger guided by respect for nature and curiosity, your adventure is ever unfolding. This concludes my first adventure. I set up camp in the forest for the night and reflect on all that has happened so far. As night falls, you find a suitable spot to set up camp in the forest. The canopy above is a mosaic of stars and shadow, the sounds of the nocturnal forest a soothing backdrop. You build a small fire, its warm glow a comforting presence in the cool night air. As you sit by the fire, you reflect on the day's adventure. The mysterious forest, the ancient shrine, the relics, and the glowing relic. Each discovery has added layers to your understanding of the world and your role as a guardian of nature. You ponder the stories etched in the murals, the purpose of the sacred relic, and the people who once walked these woods. The experience has left you with a sense of wonder and a deepened respect for the mysteries of the natural world. Your thoughts also turn to the future. What other secrets does this forest hold? What new adventures await beyond its borders? The night passes in quiet contemplation, and you feel ready for whatever comes next, grounded in the knowledge and experiences you've gained. An image forms, capturing this serene moment. You, Drake, sitting by a campfire in the forest, reflecting on your journey, surrounded by the peaceful and enigmatic beauty of the night. Enjoyed Drake's first adventure? Would you have chosen differently? To be continued, so stay tuned. Want to embark on your own adventure? Try Fantasy Adventure.